Hello and welcome to this answer explanation video. This video will take you through the answers to the make equal groups sharing worksheet and we'll talk you through some of the tricky bits. In this video I will take you through the answers to the make equal groups sharing worksheet. Question one, match each representation to the correct calculation. So we need to count up the totals and see how many groups they've been shared between so that we can match them up to the divisions. So for this one, we can see it's groups of two. So I'm going to count in twos to work out the total that's been shared here. Two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14. There's 14 all together and I can see the groups. I'm going to count the groups to see how many groups it's been shared into. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 14 shared by seven or 14 divided by seven. So it matches up with this one. And the answer is two, which is correct because there are two coins in each group. So now let's do the carrot. So we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18 carrots all together. And it's been shared into 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 groups. 18 shared by 6 or 18 divided by 6 matches up to this one. And the answer is 3, which is correct because there are 3 carrots in each group. And now for the counters, we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 10 in the first group and 10 in the second group. So I know it's 10, 20 in total. And it's shared into two groups. 20 shared by 2 or 20 divided by 2 gives us 10 in each group. So I've matched all of them up. Question 2. Circle the representation that cannot be shared equally into four groups. We need to count up how many there are in each group and then we can figure out which can be shared and cannot be shared by drawing our groups and sharing them out. So let's start with the triangles. Let's count them up. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. So we need to see if we can share it out equally by four. So I'm going to draw four groups. And I'm going to put a dot in each and count up until I get to 24. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 in this group, 6 in this group six in this group and six in the end group so we can share it by four and it gives us an answer of six because all the groups are equal so remember we're looking for the representation that cannot be shared so let's move on to the squares let's count them up one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen let's see if we can share it equally into four groups one two three four 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. I've got four in each group and the groups are equal. So I can also share my squares into four equal groups. Let's move on then because we're looking for the one that we can't share. C for the apples, let's count them up. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. We've got 12 and we're going to share them into four groups. Let's see if we can share it equally into four groups. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. I can see that there's three in each group and the groups are equal so we can also share that one equally. So that leaves us with D then, the lemons. Remember, we're looking for the one that can't be shared and the rest can be shared. So I'm thinking that this one can't, but we need to prove it. So let's count up our lemons. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Let's try and share it into our four groups and we'll see what happens. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Now I can see that my groups aren't equal because I've got 4 and 4, but then I've got 3 and 3. So I cannot share D into 4 groups. So D is my answer. Question 3. Isaac and Mia are making equal groups by sharing. Is Mia correct? Explain how you know. 
So first of all, we've got Isaac. I share 16 into two groups. Then I share those groups into two more groups. We've got Mia. I share 16 into four groups. My answer is the same as Isaac's. So let's start by working this out. Let's start with Isaac. And first of all, he shares 16 into two groups. So let's do that first of all. So we're going to put a dot in each until we get up to 16. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight in my first group. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight in my next group. So he did sixteen divided by two. And it gave him eight. But remember, he's sharing those groups into two more groups. So he's going to share his first group into two. And he's going to share his next group into two. So let's do his first group, which is eight. He's going to share that into two. Eight into two. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. And one, two, three, four. And again, he's going to share his next group into two equal groups. Eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. He's got four and four again. So he's done eight divided by two and another eight divided by two. So let's look at Mia. She shares 16 into four groups. So she's sharing 16 into four. Let's see what her answer is then. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. I can see that there are four in each group, so her answer is four. So the question was, is Mia correct? Her answer is the same as Isaac's. Well, she is correct because she's got four in each group and Isaac also has four in each group. That was the answer explanation video for the Make Equal Groups sharing worksheet from Classroom Secrets. If you want to watch a video tutorial linked to this skill, visit kids.classroomsecrets.co.uk. For more resources linked to this step, visit classroomsecrets.co.uk.